If you're looking for super cheap, fast, and reliable Madden 21 coins, look no further than my sponsor, MuttReserve.com. They're super awesome to work with, and their coins are currently discounted a ton. Make sure to take advantage and use code Poodle at checkout for an additional 15% off your order. What's going on everybody, it's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team video guys and today I'll be going over the month of October content preview. Now as you guys do know I do do this video typically like a day or two before the month is closed out so you guys have a whole idea of what the next month's going to look like. So every month of Mutt brings something different. The first month obviously comes with the, the launch stuff, some legends, potentially team of the week depending on when it actually drops. For us it was late August so team of the week fell within that first month slot and plenty of other stuff you know. That's the launch day, but after we get past the first launch month, things do start to change month to month because we start getting into the seasonal promos and so on and so forth. So, specifically, for the month of September. The month of September, guys, we of course had the 50, we had the team of the week, and as far as big promos go, like, you guys, you guys more or less know, but October is going to be different because October is going to start the kickoff of our first seasonal promos, which if you guys haven't played Madden before, seasonal promos are related to, like, as you guys know in real life, what do you, what do you know October for Halloween? What do you know uh, November 4th? That's Thanksgiving and Black Friday. What do you know December 4th? And that is Christmas. Uh, for the most part, of course, you know. Not, uh, I'm talking about in terms of Madden. That is how this usually works in regards to real life. Now, the way this is going to work for October is we are going to get... We're going to get the Halloween stuff. Now, the Halloween stuff could start mid to late October. Could start earlier. Last year, everything seems to have started a little bit later and have been behind. Hopefully, this year it is running on time. But... I do expect to be getting the most feared promo this month, of course. Obviously, it's, it's a given 100%, but we could be seeing some other stuff, which I will be going over as I get in onto this. Now, I'm going to show you guys some screenshots, show you guys how they pretty much set up all the stuff last year, so you guys will be ready, because I want you guys to understand how things are going to be working, um, how things have worked in the past, because typically they follow a similar mold. Yes, they change the players, they change a few things, but the mode's, the mold's always the same, like how they run most feared, how they run some other stuff, potentially mud heroes. Before we get on to the rest of the video, guys, make sure you're down below. Smash that like button, uh, hit that subscribe button, guys. And if you want to be a part of the Poodle Squad, you guys already know the deal. Like the video, turn on that noti bell, uh, comment down below Poodle Squad, and be subscribed, of course. Now, for today's Poodle Squad shout out, we do have guys okay, so over here on the left, as you guys can see, we have the most feared promo from last year. Now, here's what I was talking about when we say we follow the same mold like, we won't get Ray Lewis or Le'Veon Bell or Peyton Manning again. Well, we may get Ray Lewis actually, but we may not get the other ones. But the thing is, it's gonna be the same mold. So, when we do most feared, they typically do it in terms of attributes. So it's always like scary fast, scary strong, and scary tall. So most feared promo is about the most scared, most feared players in in football. Like when you get on the field, like you're scared of guys like Derrick Henry, just because how big he is and how fast and how strong he is. Ray Lewis, you're scared to run up against him because you know he's gonna destroy you. Cam Chancellor's gonna lay you out, and just so on and so forth. And then there's scary fast, like Tyree Kill, a guy that you know when he touches the ball, you fear him. You know he can score at any moment. Scary tall, like Tony Gonzalez, like Brian Finneran, like. Whoever else is really tall, guys. But you guys get the point. This is how this typically works. So last year, we have Scary Strong. We have Ray Lewis. We have, uh, this was an LTD, so it's, this is Scary. We had Scary Sharp last year, so Scary Smart. I guess a guy like Le'Veon Bell with his patience and hitting the way he hits his holes. He's smart. Uh, Peyton Manning, which I believe is Scary Sharp as well. Dante Hall, Scary Fast. Clayus Campbell, Scary Strong. Uh, scary Sharp. So, this is also interesting the way they did it last year. So, hopefully, it stays in a similar mold. You know, we're going to have collectibles. We're going to have house rules. We did have some Sunday LTDs. Like Dante Hall was a Sunday LTD, Le'Veon Bell was a Sunday LTD, and so was Calais Campbell for three straight weeks. Uh, we had a bunch of, we had, you know, we had the heroes, the set pieces. I know we had Peyton Manning set, a Ray Lewis set. It was it was a really interesting, honestly, most year, and I really liked it. It gave us a bunch of, and most year gives us a lot of good players. Like, scary fast players will be some meta players for a while, like Denzel Ward. Super, super great, of course. But that is why we pretty much like most feared, and that is what you can expect from it. I will be showing you guys some sets in just a second. But before that, I do want to go over to Mutt Heroes, which is probably the next thing we can expect to be seeing from this. Now, Mutt Heroes as well usually comes out actually before Most Feared. It's usually, last year it was the first few days of October. It'll probably released sometime in the next week or so, uh, right before Most Feared. Now, the thing with uh, Mutt Heroes is it's going to be, it's going to have its own little theme to it too, of course, superheroes. I went over this if you guys have watched those videos before, but I'm going to just recap it here. Uh, last year we got four LTDs. We got Aaron Donald, Jadavion Clowney, Alvin Kamara, and George Kittle. And they had these super cool comic book-esque like cartoon uh, cards, which I really like. And then the regular cards are just 90 to 91 overalls. Just some players that have, you know, and it, it, the best part about these cards is it really highlights their, their best attributes. Like Jalen Ramsey is I guess it's his press, his man, how good he can stay on you. Uh, let's say for Saquon Barkley was his carrying. Like he doesn't drop the ball or whatever, so that's a superpower, his carrying. Jamal Adams, 
hit power. Now the thing with these cards, whatever their superpower, you know, per se is, the best part about it is that's that stat's gonna be ultra boosted in terms of other stats. So with guys like Ramsey, if he's a man coverage guy or whatever, he's gonna have really great man coverage compared to everyone else in the game. But their card's still gonna be good. Like Jamal Adams has a very well-rounded card, plus crazy hit power. So that makes him even more usable versus just a well-rounded card, which is why I like my heroes. There's gonna be a lot of bums in here, a lot of guys that you're not gonna really want, but at the same time, there's gonna be a lot of guys that are just super great at what they do and are gonna be really, really good cards to have. Again, there's 32 total. Uh, it would be cool if they did like a master this year or something with the LTDs, but they just stick to LTDs. That's of course fine too as well because we do have most fear shortly after. But again, never gonna argue with a expansive version of a promo from last year. But Mud Heroes would be super cool. That's probably all we get for this month though. I mean, we're gonna get the team of the weeks upgrading slowly, some legends, maybe some cool surprise LTDs. But for that month of October, it's pretty much really most fear oriented. And as far as most fear guys as well, and there will be enraged cards as well. So remember, when you get up to Halloween for that for the 48 hours from I believe the day before Halloween through the day of Halloween, um, pretty much, or yeah, so pretty much the cards are gonna be super boosted, like Peyton Manning or Dante Hall Clay. It doesn't matter who you have, any card in the most fear promo will enrage. Now enrage means their stats usually go up or they get super tall. Like in years past, players have become seven feet tall, eight feet tall, and their stats have all been increased by plus five or something like that, which is super crazy if you get like a guy like you know Tyler Lockett which get enraged most fear with like a 95 96 speed in october which is just absolutely absurd but about it for that let me go show you guys the sets and stuff so guys we're over here on madden 20 which was last year's madden to show you guys kind of how this stuff does end up working out so coming on over to the most feared promo right here as you guys see this is going to contain pretty much everything most feared so we had scary sharp scary strong scary fast crafting materials masters so these are the masters we had um paid manning ray lewis just like usual last year same exact concept you do the thing you get back the players and that, you pick the ones you want, the usual stuff that you do in terms of this. Now, that's gonna probably stay the same, I can imagine. Now, um, Scary Sharp, Scary Fast, Scary Strong, and we also had Scary, could've swore there was one more, but again, they usually do three. That is kind of the mold here. Now, they did get rid of Scary Tall for this year, which is kind of annoying, but I did like Scary Tall, gave us some really cool players. But again, the only issue with Scary Tall that honestly, I can see why they got rid of it, Scary Tall gave us some it was either hit or miss because scary tall typically was called i called the scary slow because we get guys like we got we would get guys like larry Fitzgerald or a slow tony gonzalez which is kind of weird that they did that but i guess scary sharp i mean i guess scary sharp had a similar mold of a slow earl thomas slow casey hayward uh i mean hopefully they do go ahead and actually make it a bit better this year in terms of that but i do enjoy this nonetheless and then of course we had crafting materials which is pretty cool you can build collectibles to make players we get house rules and stuff so again that's awesome and then for the mud heroes coming on over to archive which is probably where this is right here mud heroes again super cool 16 offense 16 defense let's see what we're working with we had mitchell swartz tyler boyd drew Brees, batonio saquon barkley now only a few of them were super great which was mitchell swartz was good saquon barkley was good uh, of course david castro was amazing Mitch Morse was Mitch Morse was decent. Greg Olson at the time was super good. Brandon Cooks, of course, was good. Now it was pretty much it for that. And then for D, so we had like four or five really usable ones. And then here we had Deion Jones, Jalen Ramsey, Kyle Fuller was actually really good. Um, JJ Watt was decent. Jamal Adams was insane. And that was pretty much it. So we got like four or five usable from each one. So we got about ten usable players, which honestly. 10 usable players to me is a win. Yeah, it's 32. The ratio is not great there, but still, I think that's a win to me in my book, at least. So I'm super excited for both these promos. I don't really expect anything else for the month. Now, of course, it's a new Madden. They could surprise with something new this year. It's very possible. But regardless, if it is Mud Heroes and Most Feared, I'm fine with that. Now, if they throw anything else in, that's just a bonus at this point, because of course, it just really depends. But guys, better for the video. Hope you guys did enjoy. If you guys do need coins for anything, you know, Mutt related, stock up for Most Feared or Most, you know, Mud Heroes coins are currently discounted over on Mud Reserve. Go down below to the description. Click on the link. Go pick up some coins. Use code Poodle for an additional 15% off. Take advantage, guys. But that's about it for the day. I hope you guys did enjoy. Uh, it's probably the only other video I'm doing for the day because we don't have too much today. Just team of the week. But that's about it, guys. Enjoy the rest of your day. Let me know down below what you predict for most fear or Mud Heroes or anything you want to add. But that's about it. Enjoy the rest of your day. Bye. Peace.